Hey guys, and welcome to Thursday. Uh, for all of you that are in Adelaide, I don't know why we live here. It is like Antarctica. I'm not really dealing with it very well. And I'm jealous of every single one of you up in Queensland and every other warm place of the world. Anyway, today I wanted to have a chat about doing what others don't to achieve what others won't. But I want to take it out of the context it's usually spoken in. Uh, because I guess we hear that a lot and what we naturally think about is working 20 hours a day and grinding and hustling and you know almost killing ourselves to achieve the things that others won't and I'm not sure if I really believe in that and I want to shine a light on a new way of thinking about it uh, and a, I guess the way that I've started to think about what this actually means for me um, and because I think I think that working really hard and doing these 20 hour days and hustle, hustle, grind, 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 you know what? Everyone's doing that now. That's not actually the thing that others aren't willing to do. There's a, a crap load of people that are actually willing to go out there and near kill themselves to achieve the things that they think that they want. Uh, so that's not different to the rest of the world anymore. Like, you know, people, people are doing that. Um, and I think the majority I uh, actually do believe that is what is required to make it and and I disagree uh, What what would happen if you actually didn't do that? What happens if you didn't work crazy ass hours and hustle and grind and you know push yourself to Crazy limits where you are, you know going through burnout and getting sick and you know You have don't even know who where your friends are anymore because you've been working 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 what if you actually took a day off for self-reflection when you were really busy? You know those days where you're like, there's no way in hell I could take a day off today. There's so many things I've got to do. What if you just took a day off anyway? Because I guarantee there's not many people that are willing to do that. But there's something really quite magical about doing that. It's putting yourself first. It's, uh, you know, making sure that you do have the energy to do it well. You know, saying no to everyone that wants, wants, wants from you today uh, you know, it can actually be really beneficial to all of those people when you say, you know what, I'm not here today, and you come back and give it to them when you're at full energy, when you've got more to actually give. Uh, you know, what if, what if instead of working so hard you didn't have to feel anything, you actually dug deep down into the core of your emotions uh, and found out the actual problems, you know, the cause of your problems in your life. And that's not, a, that's not a really nice thing to do. Most people aren't willing to do that. We can actually, we can all look at the things that happen to us and complain and blame other people and blame external situations. What if we turned around and looked at ourselves and, and became responsible for absolutely everything that happens to us, for us essentially, uh, you know, that is something that most people aren't willing to do. That's actually against the grain. What if you uh, said an empowered no to things? You know, sometimes things look like a really good opportunity uh, and, and sometimes it's an empowered no to that opportunity. It might look like lots of money. It might look like something that's going to solve your problems, but is it in line with your values? Is it in line with what your why and why you're trying to actually achieve things? Is it in line with, you know, your actual dreams and goals? If your dreams and goals are, I want to spend more time with my family and hang out with my kids and go on holidays. And you say yes to this, you know, a few hundred thousand dollars because, you know, it's, it's a few hundred thousand dollars, but it takes away all of the things that are actually important to you. It takes away your why. Hmm. Uh, you know, what if, what if you actually looked at the people around you and removed yourself from the people that aren't helping you get there and you stopped listening to all of the, all of the opinions of everyone else and stopped, uh, stopped needing the opinions of everyone else? What if you made room for people that support you, empower you and lift you? What if you stop listening to the opinions of everyone else and because actually they're projecting their own fears on you most of the time uh, and listen to your own voice? What if you just put all of that crap aside and listen to yourself, looked after yourself, gave yourself days off when you felt like a day off? What if you did what was completely against the grain and everyone else would actually call you insane? Because for me and from what I've seen, these are the things that are actually going to uh, help you achieve the things that no one else will achieve. Uh, you know, they're the things that most people won't do. They don't please everyone. They actually displease most people. You'll upset a lot of people doing this. People will be scratching their heads going, 
what the hell are you doing, man? You need to be working hard. You can't create everything you want by working six hours a day and hanging out in a hammock and journaling and, you know, seeming like this like little magical creature. It's not going to work. People don't like it. It project that they they can't imagine it working. They have fears against it. So it is actually completely against the grain. So when people say and when you hear, uh, you know, do what others don't so you can achieve what others won't, stop thinking about it as as this massive you have to hustle and grind and work 20 hours. You do not have to do that. These are actually the things for me anyway that I find that most people won't do. And these are the things that I think will actually take you to the places you really want to go. Hello, Kylie. Thank you very much. I'm glad you agree. So uh, that's it for me today, guys. Have a think about what that means for you to do what others uh, don't so you can achieve what others won't because it doesn't mean it doesn't mean all the crazy things you think it mean. It doesn't mean what all the memes out there are saying. It means looking after yourself at the end of the day and not many people have the courage to do that. Cool, guys. I'm out. I will see you all tomorrow. Have an amazing Thursday night. Bye.